You may know it as a place that lights up orange to celebrate victory, but an event 30 years ago still casts a dark shadow over the UT Tower. And there is a sniper on the University Tower firing at will. Several persons have been injured. 31 people were injured, 16 others were killed when UT student Charles Whitman went on his rampage. After murdering his wife and mother, he then killed three people on his way to the tower's observation deck, then shot and killed 11 more from up here. The tower shootings have become a part of our culture. Films from Full Metal Jacket to Austin's own Slacker have immortalized that dark day. 23 years this summer, this town has always had its share of crazies. I wouldn't want to live anywhere else. The story behind these headlines has also been mentioned in song and in books. There's even been a website. And some have chosen to make light of the tragedy, using dark humor on a t-shirt. It's one of their fastest sellers, if not their fastest seller. In fact, this t-shirt right here is the only one they have. And that's why I'm going back to the presses tonight to print. Today, the observation deck of the tower remains closed, not because of the shootings, but instead due to a series of suicides from on top of the tower. From that top, it's an awesome sight. You can see the view Whitman had of the entire campus and its surrounding areas. You can also see evidence of bullets that were flying toward the tower. More than a few people had opened fire on the sniper, trying to bring him down. Whitman was eventually killed, but not before he changed an entire city and the way we look at the UT Tower.